Hey guys, this is Andreas, and I'm doing a quick review of the Weekender Chuka by Red Wing. So, um, this is actually a few, we a few weeks ago when I um, bought them in the Red Wing store in, uh, in Berlin. Yeah. And I bought them uh, like in, in summer because I uh, felt it was a bit warm in the Iron Rangers or in the other boots um, that I own. And uh, especially um, because throughout the summer when it gets hot, I'm usually wearing um, my Vivos, Vivo Barefoot here. And I wanted something which is a bit more lighter than the, um, the boots um, that I usually wear. And as an exchange um, when I'm not wearing the uh, Vivo Barefoot. As you can see, um, they are holding up pretty well for the start. They have quite a few marks already, although they're... Um, only a few weeks old, but this is the typical uh, rough out uh, leather of uh, Red Wing, and I guess they will um, get quite a nice patina over the time. What you can see, which you can see here already, with the laces where they usually get uh, a bit more worn out right from the beginning. Um, unlike the other Red Wing boots, this is not a Goodyear well construction, this is uh, stitch on. A stitch um, construction which is a bit different since I'm not a cobbler um, and I'm not really an expert um, I can tell you a bit more about that but you can have a, a look at the other YouTube videos which are yeah out there uh, and where you can see what the difference is between the um, the red wing boots and the um, like the chukas here what I like about the, the Chukas uh, is actually how light they feel. They're really good summer shoes. You can really feel the difference between like the um, other really, really uh, heavy boots um, and um, the Chukas here. And I also like um, that they're quite really comfortable from the start. So no uh, like breaking in period. I had quite a couple of days uh, where I really felt how smooth they um, become but now I really love them uh, like quite after the first um, walk I took them, I wore them already in the in the store and uh, I just took them home and they yeah instantly felt great on my foot um, also unlike the other Red Wing boots they uh, don't have this leather um, or cork insole thingy um, they have a special insole which is then from Red Wing also. So this is the Comfort Force, which is meant to absorb some of the yeah pushes or some of the things that you that happen from time to time when you walk around with them. Yeah. I've uh, worn them at the beginning without the um, the insoles, which felt also quite comfortable and great, but they felt a bit like slippy and a bit too big, actually. And so I chose the, um, the Comfort Force insole, and yeah, I added them back again. As for the sizing, actually, um, they are even um, bigger than my normal uh, Red Wing shoes. Usually, I'm wearing a ten and a half, and here I had to size down even um, half a size, so uh, they are like size ten. And if you compare them with the um, with the Red Wing, the boots here, for example, with the Iron Rangers, I can show you in a second. You can see that they're like almost really the same size. Yeah? So if you take a look, yeah, yeah, you can see it's like these are like my uh, Iron Rangers, which are size uh, ten and a half, and these are the Chukas, which are size ten. And you can see that from the sizing, sizing-wise, they're almost exactly the same. So uh, I would recommend you try them on before you acquire them and before you buy them, or you, uh, yeah, you size even down a bit further, um, because you can also just wear them without the insoles um, if you feel that they're like too, too tight, yeah, or too, too small for your feet. Yeah, overall, I think it's a great, um, a great choice, even for, uh, especially for summer. Yeah. Um, and I'm very satisfied with them because the quality, as you are uh, like aware, is um, Red Wings really good, good leather, and it's really nice. So they already um, had some hard times uh, when it rained outside. Um, you can see that there's some small, yeah, 
small marks already here and I'm expecting uh, them to um, yeah just to get a bit more patina and a, and a bit more character over the times I will keep you posted um, like maybe in a year or so I will do another one another review and show you how they uh, aged and, and how they developed uh, over the time and if you're interested uh, you can drop me a comment and I can also give you a little uh, overview about my other boots that I'm uh, having here uh, which is for example the Vivo Barefoots which are like um, yeah for summer as well they're a bit older um, as the other ones my Iron Rangers and uh, for example also the uh, the Elden Indies um, that I'm usually wearing just let me know in the comments and I'll do the next uh, review about one of these boots. Thank you. Bye-bye.